to another episode of the Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. <laughs> oh my god. I literally just opened the game and look who's standing outside our house. I'm so incredibly sad that she died. So incredibly sad. Um, <laughs> what did we do last episode? I believe we got Ella pregnant to Eric Lewis and uh, we killed Vivian, the cursed lady, because I, I believe that it's because of her curse on our family that George lost his dad and we lost Isabella, so she's, she, her grave, her gravestone is here. Um, I will make like a little a little uh, cemetery on our lot at some point, but for now, everyone's just out the front. Um, and we've just got Michaela and Jamie and Naomi and Lorena left in our house because Kelsey actually got married and is pregnant and moved out um, in the last episode. So we are a few, a few kids short. That means we can have, I believe, three more kids until I need to move someone else out. Um, but Lorena has a B, Naomi has a B, Jamie has a C, and Michaela hasn't even really gone to school yet. Look at them all sleeping here, just beautifully. Oh, didn't mean to go down like that. Like, they are just the cutest. I can't get a good angle, but they're so cute. I love them. Um, so, naturally, I'll be trying to get their school grades up and uh, trying to have more babies. I'm just still absolutely devastated that Isabella is dead. I'm kind of, kind of thrown off. I don't really know what to do now. Like, I used to go fishing a lot to earn money, and <laughs> now it's like... I don't know. It feels weird having a dead, uh, a dead, a dead child in the 100 baby challenge. It just feels weird. Anyways, <laughs> I'm gonna stop rambling. Um, sorry about that. And we're going to clean up this mess of a house. Look at all this disgusting mess in the bathroom, especially. <sighs> so the goal today is uh, to get some more of my all of Ella's uh, current kids up a few grades at school and to go fishing and make money I guess. Alright everyone's doing their extra credit and some chores. We've tended to the garden and uh, gosh oh hello who are you? Hello there. Uh, cheerful introduction. He seems like a catch. Ha 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 ha. Uh, that was terrible. <laughs> oh damn, Ella's looking fine. Now kiss. Hee ha ha. Well, I guess that's it for now. Bye. Uh, but we maxed out our uh, romance uh, thingy meter. So he's definitely the next baby daddy. Um, <laughs> uh, that was easy. <laughs> no, let's have some food because we're so hungry. Uh, first of all, we need to clean out the spoiled food, so let's do that. I don't know why the little uh, tombstones turned back into urns, but I've made like a little fenced off area, so hopefully no one will be upset. Um, I put a little uh, plant up here and I put some flowers and stuff. <sighs> so hopefully now that's out of the way, um, everyone will stop getting upset about it. Uh oh, what's going on here? Is she chasing him or stalking him? <gasps> Drama! Peyton Hilton, are you stalking Mr. Landgrab over here? And it looks like he knows about it too. He's like, hmm, is she still following me? I wonder. And she's just like, I'm going to find out where you live. 
Now, I don't know if you guys remember, but when we were trying to get George married, uh, Cassandra wasn't aging up, and I believe that's because of my settings. Um, in here, where I've got the auto age, only for my active household. So I think I'm going to have to... I think I'm going to have to turn this on, and I think I'm going to have to turn this on. I don't know. But, uh, <laughs> um, I guess hopefully that will help now. <laughs> Straight out of bed and into the arms of another man. Wow, that was easy. It's getting so much easier to, like, pick up guys. Now kiss! <gasps> Mortimer! Who invited you in? That's not my front door anymore! Why does everyone think that's my front door? Do I not have a door here? I have no door? What the hell happened to my door? Bloody hell! Get the fuck out of my house, Mortimer! I wondered what had happened. <laughs> Oh, that explains that. Oh, George and Michaela reunited. How you doing, George? All right. <laughs> you can come in, Kelsey. Make yourself at home. This is your home, after all. Ah, oh, congratulations. Now we're going to tend to the garden. Because we need some more money. Hey George, how's your baby going? Are you actually like... Have you got a baby yet? Hold up. <gasps> what? Ella Hampton... Oh! Oh! After this baby, Ella's gonna be an elder! Did that much time really pass? Oh my god! You guys! We're almost at Generation 2! Season 2, I guess. I don't know. Am I doing this in seasons? <laughs> That's so exciting! And it's almost Lorena's birthday. Holy crap! This is amazing. I had no idea that this was, like, this kind of episode. Um, what was I actually going to check? Right, I was going to check the family tree. Isabella, deceased. Death by laughter. Oh my heart! Uh, my heart hurts. Um, if we don't have a girl this time around, uh, Michaela will be our heir. <gasps> That's exciting. <laughs> and if we do, uh, obviously they will be our heir. However, if we have twins, I think we'll have to wait until they... Well, I mean, I guess it's whoever's born last. I guess whoever's born last will be the heir. That's a, that's a, oh man, that's a, that's a scary thought, guys. So, Kelsey is married to Travis. Uh, her siblings are Lorena and Ellen and Misael? Misael? I don't know. Um... Emerson is her dad, and Nyla is her stepmom. <sighs> wow, this family is extended, huh? Oh no! Oh, that's right, Isabella was Mortimer's daughter. Oh, that makes me sad. But Mortimer's other daughter is <laughs> married to our son. Oh, that's a bit creepy. So George, George's dad was Dennis, and his Half sister was Alice, is Alice, um, who Isabella was getting with, which is a bit topsy turvy, but you know. Um, so yeah, that's kind of cool and interesting. Oh, that's right, Jamie and uh, Naomi are twins, I forgot about that. And Michaela's dad is Case! Ah, oh, this is so like. I knew all of this, but I kind of forgot, if you know what I mean. It's just really interesting to me. 
Alright guys, Ella has been fishing all night because she is in her third trimester. Uh, I wish I could like cheat a bathroom into here. <laughs> she seems to need to pee a lot. If we need to go home to pee, so be it. <laughs> to pee and eat. But um, I'm trying to get her to go into labour in the glade just because I think it's kind of nice. But before I take her home to pee, we caught a piranha! with uh, koi as the uh, bait. And we also caught two sturgeons and three salmon. I'm going to sell all of our fish now um, and then I'm going to take Ella home so that she can pee and grab a snack and then she can come back to the glade to hopefully go into labor. I just think there's something so magical about the glade, you know? It's super nice. I like it here. Ella's home, she's going to the bathroom, and then she's going to have some food, and then we're going to try to take her back to the glade. Whoa, uh, please eat that. Please eat. Please? Alright, we are here. Ella is uncomfortable, but that's okay. We're going to fish with some pomegranates because we keep catching a lot of them, so it's okay. Um, and we're going to hopefully go into labor any minute now. I don't know what to do. I don't want her to go home. I suppose she needs to go home. Go home. Go home. You have no choice. Damn it. These babies just don't want to come out of the glade. Oh well. We'll answer the call of nature and then we'll see what happens. Maybe the babies will come at home. That's alright, I guess. It's not as magical, but it will do. I just really want to have these babies or this baby. We shall see what comes of this. Use the toilet, please. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Ella has reached gardening level 8. Boop, boop. Come on, I want to have those babies. Or the baby, I don't know. But hurry up, please. Oh, <gasps> yes! Finally in labor. Go to the toilet, please, before you wet yourself. You can clean out the food, just do some general stuff while we're waiting. Oh my god! Could you hurry up? Hey, Sims 4, I just had an idea. What if, with our food scraps, what if you made like a composting system so that we could fertilize our garden? I don't know if you've already done that in expansions and stuff, but that would be cool. I was just thinking about how much waste from the Sims kitchen is probably going into this black plastic bag right now. It would encourage uh, composting in real life, which would bring awareness to some ecological uh, stuff. So let's let's start the discussion. Just in case, and I don't mean that I think they're going to be boys. It just I think it fits the blue theme. Um, but yes, just in case. So let's see. Have baby. Go! It's go time, honey! Here we go! <gasps> it's a girl! <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's Amy! <gasps> and we had a boy! Christian! We had twins! A boy and a girl. Whoa! We had twins uh, that don't look like twins. I know that happens in real life, I just wasn't expecting it. <laughs> That's cool. So which one's which? What's this one? Amy! <gasps> That's beautiful and completely unexpected and gorgeous and I love it. I love it. Oh, that's our air, guys. Oh my god. And I guess now it's probably... Oh. Oh no. Six days till age up. Maybe it's not our air. We'll see. This is adorable and awesome. 
There we go. We had our twins. Oh, how beautiful. I'm super duper happy with that. Oh, that's just precious. Just precious. Now, to end the episode, I'm going to go... Uh, what am I, what am I gonna do? Oh, that's right. We're going to have Lorena's birthday. Just real quick, so I'll just zoom to that point. <laughs> Lorena got the uh, Renaissance Sim aspiration with the quick learner boost trait thing and the glutton trait, which is really gross, but that's what we got, so there we go. Thank you so much for joining me for another episode of The Sims 4. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Later!